Reach Out Orb is supported by a comprehensive classroom package that includes the game itself, the teacher resource that has lessons mapped to the components of the game, and lastly a how-to guide that will support teachers in helping their students with some of the technical components of the game. The heart and soul of the package is the game. In the game, students enter a virtual world and embark on a quest. In the quest, they'll encounter the glitch, which has drained colour and positivity from the world and is causing characters and machines to behave oddly. Students interact with characters in an attempt to return positivity and colour to the world and solve the glitch. In all, the glitch is spreading gloom and negativity. Uh, and all the characters are experiencing strong negative emotions and challenges. So the teacher resource is designed to pick up some of the key messages of the game and help the students to apply those messages to their own well-being and to their learning. The teacher resource is designed as four positive education lessons that pick up the key messages of the game. The first lesson helps the students to understand mental fitness and how important mental fitness is for their well-being, as well as help them to identify and use their strengths. The second lesson focuses on positivity, the third on posi developing positive relationships, and the fourth on resilience. And all lessons help the kids to apply those messages to their own life. The teacher resource in ORB links to the National uh, health phys ed curriculum and also the New South Wales PDHPE curriculum and as well as the ACARA general capabilities of critical and creative thinking, ethical behaviour, personal and social competence. It makes sense to teach the first lesson first, the lesson on mental fitness and helping kids to identify their strengths. But then there's flexibility in the order in which you do the lessons. The second lesson is positivity, the third relationships and the fourth resilience. But if you have a particular need in your class and you'd like to explore one of those issues in more depth, you can go there first. Um, so do resilience first if you like. And also there are optional activities which allow you to go in more depth in some areas. The How To Guide is a resource available for download that explains some of the more technical components of the game. It helps teachers to understand the features of the game, as well as some of the more technical components such as downloading the game, installing the game and getting the game started in the classroom. It's basically a compilation of frequently asked questions that will help you help your students in playing the game. Join us in the next video for an interactive game session to see Orb come to life.